I'm David Carter, and this is my... This is my apartment. My apartment is a little less barren than it was the last time we made a video. Uh, I'm really happy about that. Now, it's kind of like, I need a little security. So I'm creating curtains out of this material that we got from Alex's parents' house. Um, and we turn them into delectable curtains. Who doesn't love a good uh, curtain? I cut the sides to pick the window that I want. Now I'm just gonna clean up the edges and also give it a little flare. I'm just gonna put some stitches in it. Um, the thread, oh, this, I got this from Dollar General and Walmart. Was this Walmart? From Walmart and I think it was like $3. It might have been four now I'm thinking about it. Uh, super steel. Not free, but I mean, look at all that. There's like thread, push pins, needles, a measure on tip, a thimble, a, a stitch ripper, um, a pin cushion, buttons, uh, a threading device, uh, the, and it comes in like this nifty little, oh, and it came with scissors. Bam. It's nifty. You want to take the material and then, you know, sew it to, or you can cut it. Nah, I don't want to cut it though. I'm going to add, it's going to add weight to have this extra stuff folded over and that'll hold it, you know, in the wind. May not necessarily stop it from blowing about, but it'll definitely cause it a little restriction. So you want to fold it over like that. I like doing projects myself. My grandmother taught me how to sew, actually. She and I would make these rough-ass curtains when we first moved into the daycare that we worked together. Cece's Place Child Care. My grandma ran child care for ever. She was a, a grade school teacher, an elementary school teacher. Pre no, she was a preschool teacher. <laughs> she liked working with babies. Get your pens. Pin it in a few places so we don't have it moving. Not like it. We're not doing anything intricate, but this is more or less to keep it from like going all haywire when you're like getting closer towards the other side and like the material gets a little lamp. And I'd probably take about a finger length down and sew it. That way you can send a rod through it. Uh, you could put a rope through it and create like a, a rope blind holder. Like if you have nothing on hand, tape. Tape, 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 tape. Take it from a queen. I plan on using this any old color. Ooh, let's finish, oh, the brown's not very much left. Oh, well, let's finish off the brown. Ooh, you wanna love somebody, oh. Want to love somebody. Oh, you feel so good, so good, so good, so damn so good. I like this big set needle because it gives me more like hold up feel. It's so much better. Shove it through there. And you take this, and you pass it like a kidney stone. And then you retract and follow through. BAM! Empty black spool, that's funny. So, we have a lot of interesting edges, but I think it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. What we wanna do is create like, a solid security suture there. So you just wanna go over it a couple times. This is a shower rod, but I also think it was in the closet originally. Used to hang like towels, I mean not towels, uh, our coats on. Um, like, 
who are walking on the steps cannot see through the muck through the curtain <laughs> so this was a, a curtain that I did um, out of material that I got from Alex's parents house and this is a rod that I got from the Walmart it was two dollars and ninety four cents so technically Walmart. I spent about I don't know I think seven dollars um, uh, most of it was just like the stuff that I couldn't put on the house deal without it being trash and getting duct tape. Ah! Maybe you don't sew. But man, just get you some needle and thread. These two just ain't gotta be gorgeous. Ain't nobody noticing them. Look at that gorgeous pattern with that beautiful sunshine coming in and this wonderful dressed window seal. Window treatment at night time. This was four dollars at the thrift store. Yes. This is the product of Alex's mother. Thank you for visiting my apartment. I'm David Carter and this has been Designing David. <laughs>